Welcome back, DJ. Today we're gonna be making a lava lamp using our processor, food coloring, water, vegetable oil, funnel, a container, and a glow stick. Hey K Crew, we're back. Now, this part is a very important step, and I suggest getting a parent or someone of age to help you along with this process. Now, the first thing we're gonna do is we're gonna pour in a little bit of cooking oil. Uh, go ahead, Cadence, very carefully. Take your time, and we use we're using a funnel to help aid her with her pouring. Very slowly, just take your time. There you go, slow it down, keep it going. And we actually have a towel on the table, so just in case there's a little bit of spillage, you know, sometimes the younger ones have a little issue. It's okay. That's why we have the towel there. And she's gonna pour all that vegetable oil inside of there. Now, depending on what, keep going, what type of container you have. <laughs> Depending on what type of container you have, that's the amount of oil you're gonna need. Now we could have used a little bit more oil, but that's okay. All right, Cadence, go ahead. The next step is to take the water bottle. Now you're gonna pour the water in there very carefully. She has a little bit of oil on her hands. Very carefully, pour it in slowly. Now with the water, as you can see, it looks like the water is floating down to the bottom. And the reason for that is because the water is more dense. It's making it too high. It made it high. That is really cool. You see how the water floated down to the bottom? That is because of density. All right, now the next step that we're going to do is, Cadence, you can go ahead and take your funnel out to give you a bit more room. Stick it inside of your measuring cup. That'll be perfect. Alrighty, now go ahead and take your food coloring. Now you can use any food coloring uh, color of your choice. Katie's decided to use blue. This is my favorite color. <laughs> Alright, you're gonna squeeze a couple drops in there. Pay attention and make sure it's going inside. At this point, we are going to do the greatest part. We are going to add in our next ingredient. Cadence, what is our next ingredient? Now guys, this is a medicine, so please be very careful. Put the alka into a couple of pieces. Good, now go ahead and drop one in. Let's watch that. Go ahead and drop in another piece. We can start to see some action happening. Look, Cadence, do you see it? Do you see it? Break up the rest. Keep it going, keep it going. Keep it going. That is super cool. Keep it going. Now, just for fun's sake, I'm gonna go ahead and go out on a limb here and let Cadence open up the other piece of alka and go ahead and put that one in. Go ahead, get the other piece of alka -Sessor. She's ready to do that glow stick, guys. She's ready. I think that might be her favorite part of this. <laughs> I just like, I just like the whole thing. All right, go ahead, break it up. I already broke it. That's up. All right, now for the next step. We are going to use a glow stick to make our lava lamp glow. Can you activate that glow stick, Cadence? Go ahead, let me see. Let's shake it just a little bit more. Give it a little juice there, give it a little juice. 
Now go ahead and stick it inside. Now, the next step, you're going to want to close your container. All right, Cadence, hold it up. Let's take a look at it as it's reacting. As you can see, guys, see those <laughs> bubbles? That was a lot of fun, Fardy Girl. It sure was, DJ. Thanks for creating the Fardy Girl with me, DJ. Thank you for having me on, Fardy Girl. Thank you for having me on, Fardy Girl. Don't forget to like, follow, and subscribe. You can also follow me on Instagram at DJ Thunder Girl Weezy. Bye!